We got a new app earlier today. VR3 100 watt 4 channel. <coughs> I got this amp and I really didn't know what I was going to do with it because I already had the Kenwood. But the Kenwood is not really mine. And I wanted something to run to my speakers and since I got the sound streams I thought this might be a pretty good candidate for it. It's the R3 Virtual Reality Reality Sound Labs Serious Sound. I've never heard of an app like this before, but I don't really know much about it, so I can't really say good or bad things about it. Pretty good looking app, pretty clean. I don't see any scratches or anything on it, so that's a pretty good sign. You know, on this side, it's got two 20 amp fuses. I think they're 20 amp. I not really look at it. Yeah, they're 20 amp. It's got a power remote and ground. And it's got all the channels there, and it's got. If you want to bridge it to a 4 ohm subwoofer, which I'm not going to do and I wouldn't do anyway because it's only 400 watts and it probably doesn't even give out anywhere to close. It looks pretty good. That's like the only little thing on it, but I'll wipe it down and see what it'll do. <coughs> but I was looking over it and it seems like a pretty clean app. I don't we know that much about any amp like this, but if you look to the back of it, got their logo, VRA 4.0, and it says something on the bottom. O3. Really, it's got like a little something right there. I don't know. Try not to damage it. <coughs> it's got like a 84 on it. I don't really know what that is, but now y'all can see it. It's got a little 84, I guess. I don't know if that's production or something like that. And QC passed in 2004 so I guess it passed their little tests or something like that but flip it back over go on another quick view of it I really just want to give a video of just a somewhat update love it I'm gonna test it and then I'll throw up a video of it testing and see if it goes <coughs> see if it goes off the Good little green light right there. If it gives off a little green light, I might just use it. But if anybody knows anything about the VR3 or anything about these amps in general, just leave a comment or say something about them. Good or bad, I don't really know, so it'll be alright. A little quick overview of it. Sorry for the glare, but. <clears throat> Just want to give a little view of it. Until the next video, this what this is what I might have power in my sound streams. And if you don't think it should, just comment and tell me.